what's up guys welcome back to the course in this video we're going to learn prompt engineering for creating resume and cv template so we're going to utilize flow gpt so i'm just going to type in resume here and as you guys can see there are like many different uh, prompts available related to the resume you have tailor your resume a resume summarizer if you want to summarize uh, someone, uh, someone else resume then you might want to utilize this from resume editor uh, resume prompt generator so I guess if you want to uh, get the template for your resume you can utilize that basic VN resume cover letter uh, what else um, resume editor so there are like many different uh, resume right so I'm just gonna type in resume builder like this or maybe a resume generator, right? There are many of them. Um, so I'm just gonna click on this resume generator. And as you guys can see, this is the prompt, all right? So a pretty long and complex prompt. So I'm just gonna click send. And now, as you guys can see, ChatGPT is running the prompt, all right? So okay, so uh, this is the response from ChatGPT. Great, before we start, may I, may I ask what professions you're in? This will allow us to tailor your resume for your specific industry and increase your chance of getting noticed by potential employers. All right, so I'm going to type in data analyst. All right, so that's going to be our professions. That's just an example. So actually, I was an IT consultant, not data analyst. So here we go. Data analyst. Excellent. Do you have an existing resume you would like to review or refine or would you like to create one from scratch so actually i prefer to go with the second options um so i want to create uh, my resume from scratch right all right so here we go i'm just going to hit enter all right so uh, this is the response from ChatGPT. Great. Let's get started by first uh, creating a header that will include your name, phone number, and email address. Please provide me your full name and the phone number and email address you would like to use on your resume. So it's going to be Chris Raharja. Um, then the next thing, my phone number. Well, I'm just going to use, um, you know, like a random phone number here. So 0876 three five six seven eight all right just like very random number right um and the email address is going to be fintrend at gmail.com all right here we go okay cool so now chat gpt is going to process the information that we input thank you for providing that information next we will create a summary statement that will grape the intentions of potential employer by highlighting your most significant skills and experiences. Can you provide me with brief statements summarizing your experiences and skills as a data analyst? This should be approximately two or three sentences long. All right, so I'm just gonna type in, I am a data-driven analyst who has expertise in data mining, data, um, cleaning and data modeling. I have um, intermediate skills and Python, um, SQL and JavaScript. All right, I think that's it. So that's going to be my response to that questions. Uh, so as you guys can see, this problem actually is amazing guys. Okay. Can, can you imagine like how we are able to have this continuous conversation? So chat GPT keep asking, uh, more about our details, about our informations to build, um, you know, high quality resume, right? So great. That's an excellent summary. Now let's move on to your professional experience. Please provide me your Recent work experience, it should include your job title, company name, employment dates, and a brief description of your responsibilities and achievements in that role. Okay, so I'm just gonna answer this uh, briefly. So my job title, it was a technology risk analyst. Uh, the company name, 
I'm going to name it as company ABC. All right, I, I don't want to disclose my actual company name. Uh, employment date is from 2021 to 2022. All right, uh, what else? A brief description of your responsibilities. So I was responsible for handling uh, clients cyber security and data management all right so that's uh, my responsibilities or kind of like my job descriptions and i don't really have any achievement in that role to be honest with you but all right so i'm just gonna um leave it blank and all right so here we go thank you for that information can you provide me with another work experience so previously i was working too as data intern at um company maybe bcd all right so i'm just not going to disclose the name of the company for some reasons um so data intern at company bcd that's going to be the name of my company and i was uh it was from 2020 to 2021 and i was responsible for uh, product data uh, management and data extractions all right so that's uh, like my responsibility for that particular job great thank you for that please provide one lost work experience if applicable well to be honest with you i don't have any you know prior work experience so no um that's all i got all right so that's going to be my reply here okay cool so now i guess that gpt is going to generate us the resume Understood, let's move on to your educations. Please provide me with your highest level of educations, including degree, type, major, and the name of your institutions you attend. All right, so this time, uh, I think that's completely fine for me to disclose my um, like latest uh, educations. So, uh, Bachelor of Science, or maybe I'm just gonna type in like BS, Bachelor of Science in uh, Applied mathematics all right so this is actually my actual degree right uh from university of washington of washington bottle all right uh and i graduated in 2021 all right with 3.6 gpa so that's uh, my gpa it was between like 3.5 or 3.6 i kind of forget like the exact um number okay cool so now chat gpt is loading um the new response lastly uh, let's create the sections for your skills please provide me with a list of most relevant technical and soft skills that you would like to highlight on your resume some important skills to consider including programming languages data analysis analysis software uh, and any other relevant tools or abilities all right so i'm going to start with programming languages i'm going to highlight like five different programming languages that i'm pretty expert so it's going to be python um java javascript uh matlab and uh what else um Ruby. Well, not Robbie. I'm not really good at it, to be honest with you. So I'm going to go with R. All right. So R is um, programming language designed specifically for uh, data analysis. I'm also good at data extractions, data visualization, and also data cleaning. Or maybe not i'm going to highlight another thing sap all right okay cool so not just wait chat gpt is going to generate us the 
uh, template, maybe the resume template. So just wait. Uh, it might take a while. It might take you a little bit longer than usual. So just wait patiently, guys. All right. So now it is still loading. All right. So while waiting, I'm going to let you know in the next video, we're going to um, utilize prompt vibes to help us generating a new um, resume from our old resume. All right. So we're going to uh, Utilize ChatGPT to fix our resume. Okay, very cool, guys. Look at this beautiful resume. I'm just gonna scroll down. Scroll down. Okay, Chris Raharja, this is my phone. This is my email summary, professional experience. Definitely a pretty cool resume template that you can customize. Uh, feel free to add, you know, any modifications to this. Yeah, you can copy and paste this to your. Google Docs and save it as PDF or whatever. Yeah, education, skills, professional experience, a uh, pretty cool resume, huh? Yeah, so I think that's it. That's um, how you use this prompt to generate you this high quality resume. So I'll see you guys in the next video. We're going to utilize um, prompt vibes to edit or make revisions to your resume. So I'll see you guys there. What's up guys, welcome back to the course. In this video, we're going to utilize prompt vibes to uh, edit our existing resume, all right? So in the previous video, we already learned how to uh, build resume from scratch, from complete scratch. Um, this time, I'm going to assume you already have your resume, but you just want ChatGPT to help you to beautify your resume, all right? To make it more beautiful. So as you guys can see right now, I'm on promvibes.com. So all you need to do is just to type in resume here and then you have like many different options. All right. And I'm going to go with uh, ChatGPT resume editor, right? So if you go up here, uh, where is it? Um, right here, like the first one that show up here, just click on it, it will take you here. And they have a very long prom here, right? So I want you to act as a resume editor i'll provide you with my current resume and you will review it for any errors or areas for improvement you'll still look for any type of grammatical errors or formatting issues and suggest changes to improve your the overall clarity and effectiveness of the resume you should provide feedback on the contents of the resume all right so i'm just gonna use it so let's go to each other gpt and then uh, copy and paste that prompt all right so now um chat gpt is going to ask um us to provide a resume right so i'm going to pick my very old resume that i haven't touched for uh, maybe like years guys so i'm just gonna uh, open it up here so i'm gonna click find and desktop or maybe download here uh resume all right so i'm just gonna um scroll down where is it i even forget where i kept that resume guys so i really apologize if it took a while to get it okay so cool uh that's my resume so i'm just gonna uh, open it all right cool so um this is my resume so i'm just gonna copy and paste like the whole thing here and I'm going to place it here all right cool so as you guys can see i've copied and pasted my resume all right so sure, I have reviewed your resume and made some revisions for clarity, grammar, and formatting. Here's the edited version. So this is like the new versions uh, of my resume that has been edited, that has been um, corrected by ChatGPT, as you guys can see here. Pretty cool, right? Uh, it only took like less than a couple seconds. So yeah, uh, if you use this particular prompt, it's going to be very powerful where you can um, use your existing resume and then create like the new one with uh, you know, better look, right? So yeah, that's how you uh, utilize this Prom Vibes uh, resume editor. Uh, I think that's it, guys. That's all you need to know. It's definitely um, very useful, especially if you're actively looking for jobs. It's going to be uh, very advisable for you to um, utilize this Prom to help you um, beautify your resume, guys. So I think that's it. I'll see you guys in the next video.